A group of youth under their umbrella body, the National Youth Council, have filed a petition at the Constitutional Court challenging two laws that specify the age limit of persons vying for political office. The youth want the age limit of leaders at the local and national level scrapped to allow every competent Ugandan to have a shot at elective politics. The group served the Attorney General Fred Ruhindi their petition, waiting for court to set a date for the hearing. Age limit should not be a form of discrimination for people from participating. The same constitution gives power to the people. Let the people decide. If it's the majority of the young people, let them decide who should be their leader. But if you bring in such quotation, it means you are closing other people and letting other people participate. Section 12, subsection 2 of the Local Government Act puts the age limit for anyone vying for the position of district chairman at 30 to 75 years. And Article 2 of the Constitution puts the age limit for contenders for the presidency at 35 to 75 years. Now, like, for instance, in Zimbabwe, in Zimbabwe, Mugabe is 92 years of age. Isn't he a president? Hasn't he done wonders? Hasn't he helped the people of Zimbabwe? Fidel Castro has been a president. The petitioners say the age limit of political candidates should be left to the public to decide. It has some draconian laws that can no longer be based on uh, we as Ugandans, as young people, we have petitioned the Constitutional Court to come and declare that some of these positions are inconsistent with the same laws governing the land. The petition comes amidst media reports of a presidential age limit amendment that cabinet ministers have reportedly been debating about on whether to table it in parliament as part of the constitutional amendments. So, if a proposal comes to parliament about the age limit or lifting that term of age limits, I will support it, that it be removed, unless and until they want to put age limits on these elective positions. Other legislators NTV talked to vowed to block it, saying it's a move to keep President Museveni in power. We are waiting, we'll do everything possible under the sun to stop the change of the presidential age limit. Recently, a Ugandan citizen, Benjamin Alipanga, filed a petition at the Constitutional Court seeking court's guidance on whether President Museveni will be fit to serve a full five-year term after 2016 if elected into power. His argument is based on the premise that the president will be past the age of 75 years enshrined in the Constitution. An online biography of President Joe Museveni indicates that he is now 71 years old. Solomon Serwanja, NTV.